Welcome to this quick video review for the best Windows 7 registry cleaner. As you can see on the screen, we've got a tool called Frontline Reg Cleaner all loaded up. Um, this is downloaded from uh, the website, which you can go to here or in the, the link in the video description. And um, This is actually our preferred registry tool for Windows 7. Now, it's released by a company called Frontline Utilities, um, and it was actually launched earlier this year, 2010, making it a perfect tool to work on Windows 7. Um, if you're looking for the best Windows 7 registry cleaner, you basically need to look for the one that's most updated and the one that's 100% um, compatible with this system. Since it was launched in October 2009, Windows 7 has got a lot of features and files that many other re uh, Windows systems don't have. So finding the best registry cleaner that can fix all these potential problems that this new system has is essential. So as you can see, this is the home screen for Frontline Registry Cleaner. Um, I mean, as registry cleaners go, this is actually one of the easiest to use. All you need to do is click the different categories that you want to scan, and then just click Start Scan. For this demonstration, I'm just going to go ahead and do all of them. And as you can see, it uh, comes up to a, the second step of three, so it's a scanning screen here. And what it will do will be looking through the various different registry errors that are on your system, and it will report them back. Um, as it's scanning, I mean, it's, it does a deep scan, so I'm just going to pause the video and we'll come back when it's finished. Um, as you can see, the scan's now finished, and it's found 1,973 errors and 853 megabytes of junk files. Um, basically, I'm just going to quickly describe why this is important. Whenever you use a registry cleaner, it, it finds errors and fixes them inside the, the kind of the system files in the registry of your, of your PC. And um, it does this by looking through the files and identifying the problems in there. The ones that are going to fix the most problems on your PC are the ones that are going to find, identify, and fix the largest number of errors, and you know any other problems that are on your system. Now, uh, all the top registry tools um, that we've tested have only found 150 or 200 errors on this particular PC. So that's the likes of RegCure, Reg Genie, CCleaner only found about 50 errors. This one found almost 2,000. And I mean, as you can see down here, it's not like it's just found; it's just made up a random number of fake errors. All these errors are genuine, and as you'll see in a minute, you can actually choose which ones you want to f uh, fix as well. Another imp important factor to note is that it actually cleans out junk files, and this is one of the most important things of this uh, important features of this system, because junk files can actually cause Windows to uh, run extremely slowly and to have a lot of different errors, and the way that this registry cleaner does this. I mean this is actually a unique feature of this registry tool. None of the other tools actually have this junk file remover. And one of the, uh, the reason why this is important is because it's able to look through the recycle bin. So I mean if you don't empty the recycle bin that often then you know um, you be able to empty it with this. And it also most importantly looks through the temporary files of Windows. And not many people know this but Windows stores a lot of information, a lot of files in temporary folders inside the Windows folder. Now this is okay, but the problem is that Windows tends to leave these files unchecked and obviously builds them up over a period of years or months or whatever. And the bottom line is, uh, the more you use your PC, the more of these junk files will, will accumulate and will basically slow your system down. So it's refreshing to see this kind of registry cleaner able to fix these junk files and just basically make um, your PC run that much faster and that much smoother. So, I mean, as you can see, it's a very effective tool to use it you just click next to go to step three and as I said before this is where you can actually pick the different errors you want to fix you know you can do all these here and fix them you also choose to fix these or whatever and then just click fix errors um, that will basically take you onto results screen and will show you which errors have been fixed which have been left and, and essentially just give you the rundown of exactly how it's a healthy PC three simple three step system and it's highly effective and obviously there are different ways to boost the speed of your PC to make errors stop but using a registry cleaner is actually one of the most um, effective and easy to use ways to do it. Um, other things to note is uh, for, for this particular tool is that it's got a um, startup programs manager which would help boost your PC speed at the start and when it loads up. Registry defragmentation which um, basically goes through the registry and reorganizes it into, into specific areas which makes your PC run faster still. And a complete backup facility which is essential for any Windows system. So. We've used a lot of registry tools. You can see all our reviews at that website or the, the link in the video description. And um, we found that this one is actually the most effective and reliable for any Windows system, especially for Windows 7. As I said, it's developed by a professional company. Many of the tools out there are developed by amateur coders. This is developed by a professional company. 
um, and we highly recommend you download it and try it out. You can download it from the link in the description or the link below and basically run it on your PC, see how many errors it finds. If it finds a lot then you might want to consider using it to fix them. If it doesn't find so many then you might need to clean out the registry just yet on your PC. So I hope this video has given you a little bit of insight into the best Windows 7 registry tool and um, good luck in finding the best tool.